Nobody knows you when you're down and out, honey. Nobody. Wyatt! What have you done? Tuesdays. Did I get a wire into my account? Not for what you thought. Boom. Hi. Boom. Bang. This is the last episode before the mid-season finale. They're coming for you, Veronica. They think I can't take this anymore. I'm done. What the hell are you up to? You know I'm with you, right? All right, have and have not fans, they finally dropped the flipping trailer for Boom Boom Bang. And here we go. You just saw it, and let's get into it this week. Uh, why it is going to crack under the pressures of being in jail. And to be honest, um, not to make this like a short video or anything, but I've already done videos breaking down most of the major things that happen in this trailer, such as, you know, um, Catherine being upset over what Wyatt has done to himself in the cell, and then she's going to be screaming, guard, guard. Um, of course, we start off the trailer with Hannah and Catherine, and it seems like Hannah's definitely talking with Catherine, saying, nobody knows you when you're down and out. Nobody. Then at the end, she's like, you know I'm with you, right? So pretty much I feel like she's giving Catherine reassurance that everything is going to be fine. I think even at the trailer at the end of last week's episode, Catherine says, Hannah, don't worry. You know I'm going to be out of here soon, right? So, um, you know, aside from the whole executor situation, it's just that, you know, their friendship is still as strong as ever. So that's good to see that Catherine's giving Hannah, I mean, Hannah's giving Catherine some hope. And Catherine's giving Hannah hope that everything will work out and turn out okay. So, like I said in another video, based off the sequence of events, I wouldn't be surprised if the Wyatt scene is the cliffhanger ending for this episode. Uh, Lloyd tells Jim about the transfer not being what he thought. And, of course, we know it's $8.35. Candace and Jim have a little exchange about the fact that what, you didn't think I would give you all that money back after you thought it was a good idea to kidnap my brother? And then Mitch comes in to a surprise look on Jim's face, so the Malone muscle rears his ugly head again. Conley and Kyle have a brief little uh, attorney general standoff. I mean, Conley looks a bit, little surprised. Kyle looks like he's, you know, you know, you know uh, superior. Pretty much almost like, oh yeah, so you're the guy that's going to replace me, huh? Or maybe Kyle knows something Conley doesn't, or Kyle knows something about Conley that Conley hasn't made aware to Charles. I don't know. I, I just feel like if anything else, he's just kind of sizing them up like, oh, yeah, you think you can take my job, huh? It's like, <laughs> like uh, what was it, Eddie Kane talking with uh, Flash in the Five Heart Beats? Like, <laughs> you think you could take my spot? You ain't got it. There's only one Eddie Kane. <laughs> but anyway... We have uh, George and Veronica. It looks like, Ver I, might, I don't know, maybe George is going to see Veronica to kind of, you know, tell her like, hey, um, the powers that be are working against you and that arrogance I warned you about, you could have helped me when you had the chance because something tells me that if Veronica had done to George what he wanted to a few episodes ago, which was pretty much spill your guts over Catherine Cryer, and then I'll give you immunity from, you know, you sending all those goons over to David's house. But she refused to do so. Maybe George is just going to be there and warn her like, hey, remember when I, you know, asked for your assistance and now it's you rejected me. Looks like things are going to be uh, working against you. I don't know if he's going to snitch on David because if he does, that lets me know right there. I don't think the whole David file folder thing will happen because, like I said before, George saying that. Come by my office tomorrow. I'm like, first of all, it'll take like 50 episodes for David to get to your office tomorrow. Not to mention, there's no telling what Veronica is going to do to him between now and then. And then Veronica says, they're coming for you, Veronica. Think, think, think. And then we go to the next scene, uh, which is the last scene of the trailer. Well, not the last scene of the trailer, but the last scene of the trailer I haven't gone over yet. And that's Justin and Jeffrey talking. Uh, Justin saying, I can't take this anymore. I'm done. And then Jeffrey's like, what the hell are you up to? He probably is calling Justin out on his bullcrap. And not to mention, why the hell are you bringing Justin into David's house? So once again, if Justin does something, Jeffrey, you did it to yourself. Screw you. I don't care. So with that being said, that's the trailer for Boom Boom Bang. Um, let me put it this way. Next week is the mid-season finale. Own. If there's anybody from the Own Network listening, Please do not wait until the day before the episode to drop the trailer. Just please don't. It's the mid-season finale trailer. Just put out the trailer like the same night uh, or Tuesday night, the same night as the next episode or something. Because this, 
y'all ain't been doing a good job promoting the season this season. I mean, the haves and the have-nots this season, if you ask me. Like, I know that I've been one to say in the past, man, I, I, I really wish they would tone down on the ep of episode clips. Because remember, we used to get like those three little 10 to 15 second little teasers on Tuesday afternoon. And then sometimes we would get one or two 30 to 59 second clips on Facebook before the episode even aired. We barely gotten that this season. And then the trailers, they just been all over the place. Sometimes we would get a trailer on TV right after the episode aired. And then other times we would get like a 10 or 15 second teaser, but then not the actual full trailer for whatever reason. So please, this Tuesday, after the episode, show us the full trailer for next week's mid-season finale and then upload the mid-season finale to YouTube. Not just for my sake, so I can make these videos, but for other fans, so we can get hyped up for the mid-season finale. So y'all y'all just please do a better job with that. So with that being said, make sure you subscribe to the channel if you're new. Uh, thank you, we just hit 110,000 subscribers, so that's great. Um, also, hit the bell notification icon so you don't miss out whenever I post new content. Give this video a thumbs up. Let's try to go for... 125 likes you know as a goal and we can exceed that i know comment your thoughts on your favorite part of the trailer and what you're looking forward to the most this tuesday and if you want to check me out on social media links are in the description below